welcome to Soulless Trench Coats YouTuber Tag. And um, nobody tagged me for this, but that's fine, guys. No pressure. Um, I don't mind if you guys tag me or don't tag me. I'm I'm just okay with that. It's okay. Uh, but I have watched this uh, tag on uh, Sean Urshan's channel and um, John from Project Ellsworth and also Cody from h and Collectibles and I thought it would be cool to do uh, this tag as well. So, uh, you have 13 questions for this tag and it starts off with, what is your favorite thing about YouTube? And I have to say... I know I say this a lot, but it is basically um, everyone in this community, and um, when I'm having a bad day, or a good day, I come here to YouTube, and um, I just love it. You guys keep my mind off of the things that are going on in the world, or even in my life that's just bugging me at the moment, and it relaxes me, it makes me think about uh, films to either watch, or review, and... I appreciate that, guys. Even figures that I'd like to get. You guys have some amazing figures. Uh, I like watching you guys unpackage these figures. Uh, just showing off your collections. And basically, that is my favorite thing about YouTube. And, um... Two, question... <clears throat> the second question, sorry, is what is the one thing I dislike about YouTube? And I'm going to have to say, guys, is the notifications. It seems like uh, I don't get all my notifications, either on my phone or my laptop. And um, it bugs me because I have to scroll down quite a bit and check comments from, like, even a month ago. And um, sometimes I even noticed just the other day that after scrolling down through a month, I realized I had a comment that I did not even see a month ago. And I comment it back and I do apologize to that person who is maybe watching this. I don't know. And um, like I said, guys, I'll try to get to all your comments. But no, uh, YouTube is just not showing me them all. And that is the one thing I really dislike about YouTube. Uh, question three is, what are my thoughts on trolls? Well, trolls, if they give me a thumbs down only and no comments, all I just say is... Whoever gave me the thumbs down, thanks for watching. And um, if they leave a nasty comment, I'll just uh, get rid of the comment. I'm not even going to indulge in their conversation. Um, if they do another remark in the comments, I'll just block them or ban them type thing. I, I just I don't like to converse with any trolls because it's not my thing. Uh, question four is, how long have I been on YouTube? And not very long, guys. I've only been on since March 7th, 2020, which is this year. And um, it's been a blast so far. I've been having such a great time doing this stuff. And amazingly, you guys have been enjoying all the stuff I've been doing. Uh, question five, what is some advice you would give to someone starting YouTube? Well, uh, one, be patient. Um, sometimes it can get on your nerves, a little nerve wracking, uh, trying to do a video and you do a mistake over and over and over and the video is like the 10th time you're trying to do it. It can get a little nerve wracking. I've had those days where I just couldn't get the video right the way I want it. And it took me like 12 to 15 times to make it right. And, um, but as you go on, those will become easier for you. You'll start to know exactly what to do and what you're doing and how to do it properly. And, um, it'll just go by so quick and you'll be impressed with yourself, which is what I'm doing with myself right now. I'm just so impressed with how far I came since a few months ago. Um, so just be patient. And as for subscribers, uh, if they, they will love uh, your content either way. You'll have subscribers from all over the world. Um, uh, don't be scared of what you want to put out there. Uh, just don't make it too vulgar and, you know, stuff like that if you want quite a bit of people to watch it. So that's about the best advice I can give. Um, question six is, what is the best comment I have received? And I do apologize to everyone because I cannot remember who's given me the best comments. But I remember some of what the comments did say. I had some saying that I had a, a decent voice for video, uh, which is pretty cool. 
Um, uh, a lot of people say that uh, I have some really great content and keep up the great work. Um, I had some people say they really love my stuff that I have up here that I put up. And uh, I really appreciate that, guys. I even had some that said um, I really helped them out with some of the videos I put up there. Because I have a couple of videos, like gameplay videos. And even the gameplay videos are basically <clears throat> NES games. And I play that off of a Nintendo emulator, and I do have an instructional, an instructional video. I can't even say the word properly, I do apologize. Um, instructions on a video on how to use that uh, emulator and ROMs, which are games, to play on the emulator. And I did get some thanks for that, which I appreciate, guys. Um, seven, what is the weirdest thing I've seen on YouTube? Well, I come across some really weird stuff. Um, I try to stay away from all that weird Illuminati stuff. I find that just a little bit uh, too much. Um, I've seen some weird things like um, uh, live animals playing poker at a table. I, I believe uh, there were dogs. People set them up type thing. And they, they were just using their nose, pushing cards and stuff. It was crazy. But um, yeah, just... There is that. Um, there was a few other things that I've seen. Uh, people dressing up like ghosts and aliens, saying that they have seen aliens and ghosts, and you just see someone running around with a costume on in their house. Um, weird, weird stuff like that. I find that weird anyways. Uh, not comedic. I just find it um, not even creative. Just misleading to people that actually want to hopefully see some real footage. Um... Uh, question eight is, what is a video you used to love to watch but can't find anymore? Well, there's a little bit of videos that I used to watch. Most of them are music videos from the 70s and 80s. And very oddly, uh, a couple of those videos do disappear on my watch list on YouTube. And I cannot see them anymore because it tells me it is banned in my country. Which is questionable and I don't understand why. Um, question nine is, why do you watch my videos? Well, this one here <clears throat> is for someone who has tagged me and nobody tagged me. So I'm just going to say, why do I watch everyone's videos that I do on uh, YouTube? Is because uh, you guys have content that I just love. Um, you guys help me out with movie recommendations, uh, figures to get, um... You guys have a lot of films that I've never heard of or seen, and it just gives me lots to look for when I'm in a store, and I thank you guys for that because these are all interesting to me. I love old classic uh, 70s, uh, cheese 80s, you know, a little bit of the early cheese in the 90s. I even love the classic black and white films. Um, you guys have been helping me greatly greatly with a whole list of films that I've just never seen before. Um, question 10 is the one way the person who tagged me can improve. Um, nobody has tagged me, so I am going to skip this question. Uh, question 11 is what is the favorite part of my YouTube channel? And uh, I'm going to have to say conversing with people in the comments. Um, I become somewhat friends with some of them. Uh, one that one name that comes to mind is Phil from Phil's Creepy Videos. We even converse outside of YouTube, which I just think is awesome. Thank you, Phil, for that. If you're watching this, I appreciate it, man. Um, and I even get uh, some chat with a few others. I believe Death Central, uh, Kevin, you're pretty cool, man. Thanks for conversing with me outside of uh, Face uh, YouTube. Sorry, and. Uh, I appreciate you guys for doing so. Uh, I do know there's a few others that have conversed with me outside of YouTube. And I do apologize. I can't come up with your name at the top of my head. And I do thank you guys as well. Um, question 12 is, what is one way I think that I can improve? And I like to do have a little bit better editing. Um, I'd like to find some more cool effects for my videos. I also like to start doing um, uh, talking through my ranking videos to say why these are in 
those number spots and maybe a little something about that film itself and um live streams i like to start doing some live streams i think they're fun i love when people come on we converse uh, we talk about anything basically um and i just i appreciate it guys for anyone who had jumped on my past live stream and um expect more thanks um the 13th question is, do you think YouTube has enhanced your life and how? Well, I got to say it has enhanced my life big time. Um, basically, I've been sitting around my house bored for many of years. Uh, not much to do. Um, don't really want to get into my personal life too much. But uh, yeah, i am basically been just sitting around playing video games and watching movies and obviously not enough because I didn't even know about more than half of what you guys have been showing in your collections and uh, I I just makes me know that my video stores that were around me were just not that good um, but either way uh, I find like a friendship or some kind of bond connection uh, from commenters and um, I thank you all really for commenting to me and replying back to me when I comment on yours on your guys videos and um, it's almost like a horror family kind of and uh, it's what I kind of feel like this community is is a family and um, I kind of feel like I'm part of that and I thank you guys for welcoming me into that family of uh, horror and introducing me to so much more that I didn't even know about so I'm gonna stop it here guys that's going to be it. And um, it is a tag, so I will tag anyone who is watching this video. You are tagged. Um, feel free to do this tag and share it out there. If you guys have not heard of the Solus Trench Coat, I will leave a link to his uh, channel in the description of this video. You go over, show him some love, hit that subscribe button, hit the like, and write some beautiful comments. He has uh, some decent content. And I do apologize again, Solus uh, Trenchy. Um, I thought I was sub to you. I was pretty sure I was, but uh, for some reason I just wasn't. So that's going to be it, guys. Thanks for your time. Uh, you all take care. Ciao.